The city of South Bend has a combined sewer system where sanitary and stormwater go through the same pipe. And that works just fine in dry weather, but when it rains hard, it's a problem. We have combined sewer overflows into the river, and sometimes we have basement backups of sewage, which is really unpleasant for, for property owners. So we had a traditional approach that most cities, like 800 combined sewer overflow cities in the United States, are facing this challenge. And it's about a $65 billion problem. Here in South Bend, about a half a billion dollars to fix it using conventional civil engineering solutions. But we started to look at some research at Notre Dame, and we started to talk to uh, IBM as a partner and a local entrepreneur who was commercializing some of the research. And we put it together in a unique collaboration where we did real-time monitoring, real-time control of that sewer system. We're able to change the way the system can store and move wastewater during each unique storm that comes across our 40 square miles of city. And by doing that, we found an answer that was about a $6 million solution where the conventional answer would have cost the people of South Bend $120 million. So first of all, it saved us a lot of money, it protected the environment, and it protected human health much better. Our basement backups are way down, our combined sewer overflows during dry weather due to blockages are 95% less, and we are carrying 23% more of the wastewater to the plant for treatment to put clean water in the river with the same infrastructure we had before. This is a better answer.